Happy Friday, my warrior friends. I wanted to jump on here today and um, talk to you about an encounter I had Wednesday evening that really has gotten me to thinking. And um, what happened was uh, in our Wednesday night uh, event that we always have, um, well, several things happened, but one of the things, and I didn't actually, it didn't actually dawn on me until today, actually, why she said what she said. But one of the things was, is she wouldn't read the word, one of the gals that was in there, but she said she'd put it on screen. It didn't dawn on me till today that uh, the reason she wouldn't read the word, um, well, she had an opposite spirit um, from the Holy Spirit. And she knew the power of the word that spirit knew the power of the word. Well, I want to know, do you guys know the power of the word? The enemy knows the power of the word. He's afraid of it. It is the power. The, the word is our shield or not our shield. It's our sword and we should be wielding it. We should be carrying the, 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 the shield of faith and the sword of the word, the sword of truth, the sword of the spirit. We should be wielding that. You know, are we hot or are we cold? The opposite spirit that she was she was carrying was pouring off the screen there at the end. You know, and you could feel it if you were in any kind of discernment at all. And um, I had to pro it took me a couple of days to process that and to think about that. And that starts to manifest when you start walking in authority. When you're in authority, you're going to start encountering those opposite spirits and you're going to be, um, you know, a lot of times you don't even know when you're all crying, oh Lord, why did they reject me? Oh Lord, why are, why are they talking to me like that? You know, oh Lord, why am I losing all my friends? It's because you're now walking in authority and they've got other friends. <laughs> they've got opposite spirits. A lot of times they don't know that. They don't realize. Sometimes they do like the spirit that I encountered on Wednesday night. Other times they don't. They don't know why they behave behaving like they are, but it's because you're a threat. So it brings that, that opposite spirit up in them to attack you because you're walking in authority. And how do you walk in that authority? Well, you have to start, you have to come under authority. You start building that relationship with the Lord. You give him your will you're in obedience, you're seeking after him. So when you start walking under authority, you start carrying that authority. You start being filled with that Holy Spirit, which is your power. It's not by might, it's not by your power, it's by the, the, by the Spirit saith the Lord, by his Spirit, that's what you're walking in. That's what you should be walking in. So are you hot or are you cold? The, you know, Jesus wants you to be hot. The Spirit wants, to, or Jesus wants you to be hot. Satan wants you to be lukewarm. You know, he laughs at that. <laughs> so, you know, don't be lukewarm. The Lord is looking for warriors. He needs warriors. You know, you need to be carrying that sword. You need to be carrying that shield. You need to be a standard. You need to be standing in the full armor of God and understand that you are an authority because you walk in authority. You're in his kingdom now. You've been transferred out of the kingdom of darkness and into the kingdom of light. You are his child. You are his warrior. So we all need to start acting like it and realize what's happening around us, what's popping off around us. It's because we're walking in authority. You know, we're going to start encountering um, the evil, the more authority we start walking in. And we need to have the confidence of the of the power and the authority that we're that we're walking in but administer that shield and that sword and love as well so i'm looking for warriors and i know i got some some of you out there and but it starts by coming under authority so something to chew on you guys have a great weekend and i'll see you again soon